So gradually cooler conditions expected to invade Ohio during the next 72 hours. After that, well, we could be in for some sunshine, believe it or not. Let's take a look at your future view map, 7 a.m. Friday to 7 a.m. Saturday. Much of the upper Midwestern United States, I would say along I-80, that would be the main corridor, could be in for the first major snow event of the season. Low pressure located near Casper, Wyoming, with a warm front stretching southward into the lee side of the Rockies into the Plain States. That'll make its way to the east. You can take a look at the isobars, the way things are developing on this animated map. Your low pressure system will be located just to the north of St. Louis at 7 a.m. on Friday. That low will then make its way to the east-northeast, crossing Ohio on Saturday. The good thing about that is, with this system, much of the cooled air will be 100 or so miles north of the low-pressure track, but along and to the south, of course, of the track of the low, we should be in pretty decent conditions as far as temperatures are concerned, albeit somewhat chilly. There will be a mixture of precipitation along and north of U.S. Route 30 in northeast Ohio once this storm makes its way to the northeast of Ohio could receive some lake effect accumulation of an inch or two, but it's nothing to write home about. For those folks up there, they're used to it. But the first, first lake effect snow in Northeast Ohio could be an adventure. Now let's take a look at your traveler's forecast for the day on Friday across Ohio. You can see daytime highs will range in the 40s to near 50 degrees along the Ohio River. Still not too terribly bad, but again, we're taking those steps downward into the valley, the valley being the cooler temperatures and it's eventually going to bottom out around Sunday with daytime highs in the mid-30s. And then, next week, we could be in for another warming trend. But in the, in the meantime, let's take a look at your five-day forecast. So with the exception of some precipitation moving through here Friday night into the day on Saturday, it doesn't look too awfully bad, although somewhat chilly. Have yourselves a great weekend, and don't forget to check us out on social media. OhioWX.com is our website, and look us up at Ohio Weather on Facebook, and give us a like.